we are in Barangay. As you guys know, uh, <laughs> every time I fight, it's uh, <laughs> very exciting. I throw a lot of punches, been the pressure, and uh, now I'm drawing boxing. It's going to be a tough test, but uh, if I get through him, I'm going to fight or two away from a title shot, which is my goal. And it's been like a little fairy tale story, right? Uh, a little kid from Brooklyn, uh, winning the Golden Gloves, and now uh, fighting in Barclays since it's a coming event. And hopefully, uh, early next year will be the main event. So uh, that's the goal, and now uh, dreams come true. So keep working hard, and we will be the first post on the Henry Chamber as well. Thank you. I done. No, I can slow you yeah. Adam, you and I have talked in the past about you know certain guys, certain fights. Uh, Washington's an ugly fighter. He is he's about a six foot six foot seven, fights like a middleweight, he's not going to engage, right? Worried that this could be just a stinker fight. This could make you look bad because you're chasing a guy who he'll get on his back foot, throw a jab, and just run for maybe ten rounds. Uh, I think when I fought uh Yaru Yaru Plaza, he was also a runner. Or a boxer that moves a lot, and I managed to cut the ring very well with him and take round six. So uh, I'm looking to, to, to do the same with uh, Joe Washington, uh, you know, cut the ring and uh, go to her body. And uh, I don't know, you know, she's good at the yard, the hard they fall. So I had this, he's a six, six, two, going to him. And Yago's a kid that I promote, that was his game planning. You beat the hell out of him that night. I just want to know how you get that Polish music playing right during the fight. <laughs> 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 that, was that, was good. that was good, yeah. <laughs> hey, sir, here. Cameron Buford, LA News Observer. I got a question for you. You and your manager talking about fighting Wilder. I appreciate the, the fore, foresight. However, what's preventing you from overlooking Washington in this fight that you have next week? Uh, uh, yeah, it's a fourth, tough exam. The former challenger. I don't know if it's A-game, so... Uh, but my goal is to be the first Porsche every Porsche American every chance in the world. And uh, in order to do that, I have to get by George Washington. And uh, that's what I plan on doing. Thanks. Yeah, okay, hi, Adam. So, um, <laughs> how do you score uh, Wilder Fury? Sorry if you've already uh, given that answer to the press. Uh, I haven't had to sit down again and watch it again to score it thoroughly. But uh, I definitely see a draw with uh, the two knockdowns. Because that makes it uh, 2016 on the scorecards, and there were a couple of rounds where it was very close. So a draw is, uh, I think, a fair. fair uh... So uh, also, Wilder has talked about a possibility of a long count. Um, for my count, he was down somewhere between 9 and 11. Do you think there's any merit to that, or do you think uh, Deontay is kind of grasping with that? Uh, I think it's the judges, right? Uh, it's the commission's job, not, not our fighters. Uh, we just got to go to the best that we could and our ability to, uh, to make sure it's good at each other's scorecards or each other's hands. Because um, my last fight was 6-4, which, which was tough. I mean, I thought I won it 8-2, 7-3. If 6-4 was very close, I think, that was, I was, I was uh, round away from a draw. So you got, it's in our hands. Uh, if you don't want to go to each other's scorecards, you got to get a knockout, which, uh, which I always aim to do, but it's hard. So. Great. Uh, last question. Uh, do you think um, coming out of this fight, I mean, it sounds like your, your aim is to make a statement if you're talking about Wilder in the fight after this. Um, do you think at that point you would prioritize waiting for Wilder, or are you looking for 2019 to be an active year, whether or not Wilder will get in with you? Uh, I think with uh, Al and Keith as managers, uh, I have a good managerial team and uh, double side, but I want to stay active, you know, sort of. The rematch between uh, Fury and Wilder just happened. Uh, I guess I just want to stay active and uh, have one more fight for him. Any other questions for Adam? Maybe. <laughs> That's a nice name. Blackstar News. Uh, without giving any trade secrets, what did you see in Deontay and Tyson Fury that say, hey, I can compete with these guys? Uh, I'm on their level. I think my pressure, I'm a great pressure fighter. I keep coming forward. And if you don't <laughs> knock me out and get me out of there, I'm not <laughs> you know? uh, That's my style, that's the way I fight. 
And uh, the soccer had a lot of holes. I think uh, Wilder didn't go with lots of body with Fury. I think if he did some, threw more jabs to the chest and uh, the body area, it would be the fight easier for him. Maybe even get him out of there earlier. But uh, they both have holes, and uh, that could, I could definitely work on. Good, thank you. Any other questions for Adam, y'all? <laughs> what do you think about the heavyweight fight tonight between uh, Brazil and, and <laughs> Carlos? <Ron? laughs> yeah, I think it's gonna be a great fight. Uh, Diamond Brazil is also, uh, I think he's also mandatory for Robert. He's calling him out. Right. So Robert has a lot of guys uh, aiming for him. But uh, you know, uh, it should be a good fight. You know, uh, heavyweight division is live and well. I think right, we have a lot of great fighters. Everybody's in the mix. And you go, it's a big boy to go punch. So it's very exciting. So I think it's a big exciting fight tonight with uh, those two uh, young gentlemen, and uh, can we see it? Right now, everybody's expecting the Wilder to rematch Fury or get the Anthony Joshua fight. Is Brazil a fight that you may want in the future? Maybe after your fight, you guys meet up. Maybe, uh, like I said before, a rematch on team we're keeping it now. So uh, if that's one option on the table and that's the best one, that's of course you know. Um, so, uh, a couple more. Uh, do you have any history with Gerald Washington? Have you ever sparred him? Have you ever seen him fight in person? Do you have any, you know, first-hand comments about Washington? He fought my uh, good friend, Jerome. Oh, that was my next question. Yeah, so I asked him that, no. So, do you see this as a chance to compare yourself to both of them to try to make a statement? Or is this a fight where, you know, you're going into camp, a win is a win, and you just uh, are focusing on getting the W? Uh, you want to look amazing in every fight, you know, because that way um, your stock goes up, right? Especially being on Fox, it's going to be huge. Uh, my last fight on Fox was against Arthur Spirka, which I think I looked very good against. It took me on four. Uh, yeah, so, yeah, so uh, obviously I want to look good, but uh, at the end of the day, a win is a win, and uh, that's what's most important. Any other questions for Adam? All right, awesome. Thank you, Adam. Thank you so much.